Hello everyone and welcome. I hope all is well. This video will be about a Roadblox FPS shooter game called Frontlines. Yes, you heard that right. It's Roadblox. This game was brought to my attention by my kids. They're big time Roblox gamers and enjoy this platform a lot. They asked if I could make a video on Frontlines and I said, hey, why not? You know, it's a first person shooter game. The video will be more of a review and comparison versus strictly gameplay and to provide that visibility of this amazing game that's been developed for Roblox. Roblox consists of many different FPS mini games. Some of the kids favorites consist of a game called Big Paintball and you run around with your paintball marker and uh, getting your marker kills in this uh, FPS style setting which is pretty neat. And then you have Arsenal. Uh, this one is more of a, a, a gun mastery type of thing, and uh, which is pretty cool. And then you have another game called Zombie Uprising. Run around with your teammates and uh, take out a bunch of zombies. Which is pretty neat. The true icing on the cake, and what really finishes it, I believe, is Frontlines. This game amazed me. I was really impressed with the graphics, with the gunplay, just everything overall. Creator of this game is Maximilian Studios. They're a game development group uh, located in Los Angeles, California, and they've been working on this game for quite some time. I believe a little over two years or at two years, somewhere around there. But they have worked hard on this, and I'm sure there is much more content to come uh, in this game in the future. As you can see here, the home screen and menu is user friendly. You got your loadouts here. All your different guns that you can unlock as you uh, continue to play the game, just like with any other. Here's your secondary melee and gadgets and skills, is like perks in Call of Duty, which is pretty cool. Got your store, not sure what's going to be in there. All of your leaderboard statistics, if you want to see what, how your stats are. And then also your settings, general, visual, audio, and also other key bindings. Pretty cool. Very user friendly. You say, well, could this be as big as Call of Duty or Battlefield 2042 or any other of your big FPS shooter titles? I would say it has potential. It It's off to a great start. There is a lot to improve on just like with any game really and I mean just look at the graphics it, this this is impressive uh, to be on a Roblox platform I am still impressed now the gunplay you know and all the running and everything else could all can, could improve in, in many areas there there is some bugs just like with any games uh, but this one uh, to be on a Roblox platform and I'll be honest, the, the, the matches that I've played so far, it hasn't been many, but they've been competitive. And that's what makes a game great, is that competitiveness, that solid fun every match. At this time, there's not a whole lot of content, but I'm sure in the future there will be. There's about four or five maps now that I've seen. There's different game modes like King of the Hill, uh, Kill Confirmed, and domination and of course team deathmatch hey it's free if you ever want to try something new create a roblox account try front lines i've had a blast so far from the few games that i've played give it a try you might like it if you like this video uh, leave me a like and uh leave me a comment if you tried this game and i'd like to hear your thoughts if you're new to the channel um feel free to subscribe and uh We'll uh, catch you all in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.